For there is one God in heaven who is all love that will not allow evil to continue forever. For there is an end to everything under the sun. And no matter how fast and how far you run, the end is coming sooner or later. For God is the almighty God who is the only true judge. He's all love, but he's all justice as well. He's calling us to his love. But if we disobey him, he is, we are leaving him no other choice but for him to use his justice and bring down hailstone weighing heavily on us. When his, when his arm comes down, it's not going to be easy. The punishment is going to be very severe. It's going to be very painful beyond your capacity. Beyond what you can manage, beyond it. So let every human being examine their conscience. You as a prime minister, you as a president, you as a human being, you as a Christian, you as a Christian leader, examine your conscience. My friend, we ask ourselves as Christians, we ask ourselves this question, what does it benefit a man if he gains the whole world, yet at the end loses it? What does it benefit a man if he gains the whole world, yet at the end loses it? Who are you trying to please? Who are you trying to fulfill their desires? Are you trying to please yourself? Are you trying to please someone else? Are you trying to be nice before the world? Are you trying to be loved by the world? What are you trying to do, my dear friend? Because let me tell you one thing. The reality of this realm, all of us, one thing is awaiting all of us. The grave. And in that grave, nothing can go down there except me and you, my dear friend. And it's only me and you. Nothing that we ever owned, nothing that we ever achieved, nothing that we ever built, nothing, nothing, nothing. It is me and my deeds. That is all.